you know, what's up, homies and homies? Uh, I've been having phone issues the last few days, so sorry if my phone starts to glitch out randomly. I apologize about that. Um, yeah, oh, hi, thank you. Uh, we're gonna play on a server today. I'm not gonna deal with it. We're just gonna play on, um, I don't know. As we, you know, what, let's do some prison break. I haven't done it in a while. Oh, uh, yeah. Sorry, guys. I haven't been the best about uploads. I know I did re upload. I re uploaded for two reasons. One, uh, I couldn't record that day. We had way too much going on. And uh, two, I did upload originally with the wrong title. So, I thought you guys would appreciate me putting the proper title. Not now. Okay, so let's go to prison. But, yeah. Uh, I thought you guys would appreciate the correct title going down. This is just going to be one of those videos where I don't really cut too much. I'm probably just going to work you guys through it all. I don't think you guys mind too much. Oh, God. After D, E, F, mine, F. Let's go. And it's the same thing a lot of my relatives got in school. Oh, and people are here. Yay. My family wonders why I don't like to be around them. And then they decide to insult me all day. It's like, hmm, you wonder why I hate being around you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so today was the day of our uh, fundraiser that we host every year. Uh, the one where we give money to people with cancer. You know, don't get me wrong, it was a good time and all, but... I don't know, man. It's just, it takes a lot out of me, especially. Don't get me wrong, it takes a lot out of my whole family, but it takes a lot out of me because I'm not a people person and it forces me to be around people all day which i'll do it don't get me wrong i will do it for people who need help but still it's a lot you know it's a great cause um unfortunately it's over already so no one else can donate or anything sorry if you wanted to uh by the way please like and subscribe does a lot also drop a comment if you don't know what to comment um comment the word potato I don't know why today's word is going to be potato, but it is. If you guys wouldn't mind. It would be very much appreciated. So why is this so rich, bro? Honestly. I'm starting to get mad at it. I'm going to have to break that on my way up. I can even make it up. Jesus Christ, Wiener. What? Oh my God. Why is there so much stuff? This has got to be the richest it's ever been for me. We're going to be balling. We're going to be big boy balling. We're going to even use the enchanted pick. Yeah, that's how big boy balling we're going to be. We're even going to use the one-tap pickaxe. The one-tap pick. Tap. Oh. Tap, tap, tap. Oh, tap. 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 Mine. Mine. Tap. 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 Oh, tap. 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 Honestly, though, this is how Efficiency 5 pickaxe is, honestly. I love Efficiency 5 on anything, but especially a pickaxe and an axe. Those are the two weapons that I need most, that I need Efficiency 5 on on the most. Don't get me wrong, it's also very nice to have on a shovel. Does, does it speed things up? Yes. Do I hate shoveling things? Yes. Is it something I like doing without Efficiency 5? No. Oh, hi. Well, I appreciate that, actually. Oh, hi. We're gonna have to go back to the, um, overgrowth. That way we can, uh, get some more pumpkin bombs. Or jack lantern bombs, rather. I remember at one point, um, before I completed this, I had, like... 300 of them, and I was never going to use them all. Wait, 
I don't know why I decided to gather so many of them. It's not like they're difficult to gather, they're actually pretty easy to gather. And that's the only reason I did gather them, was because they're so easy to gather. And they are useful, you know, it does speed things up a fair bit. But it also can slow things down, so it's not completely worth it. It's not not worth it, but it's not com Oh, pardon me, sorry, I was having hiccups and burps all at the same time. Very much unpleasantness. But, uh, yeah. Did I say what's up, homies and hombres? I think I did. Oh, I'm really bad about that. I can never remember whether or not I said it. Get him. Oh, silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Really, bro? Really? I was busy. And then you're gonna pull something like that? Wow. Disrespectfully. I hate you. Not even a respectfully, I hate you. A disrespectfully, sir. Like, I genuinely want to punch you in the face. After I sleep with your grandma. You know, where's that old lady? I'm gonna go sleep with her now. Also, don't worry about the weird things I may say. It's, it's just who I am. I say weird things without trying to. It's like my superpower. Bro, we have so much loot, though. We are going to be rolling in the dough. And I think you guys are going to really like the next one. Like, it is super cool. I love the next map. It is honestly one of my two favorites. And by map, I mean the next zone. The next mine, I guess you could say. But it is genuinely one of my favorites. I wouldn't say it is my... I don't know, maybe it... It could be called my favorite. Just because, like, I will, will go on it even when I don't have to. Because it is just such a nice one. Okay, oh, wow, oh, wow. Jump, 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 jump. Okay. Boom! Boom! Boom. And boom. You know what? I really did expect just to get more, I think. Uh, yeah, we're definitely gonna have to uh, sell it all. Yeah, we're gonna have to, uh, we're gonna have to go to the overgrowth. I genuinely thought we were gonna be making Mad Bank. Which, don't get me wrong, we did make Mad Bank, but not nearly as much of Mad Bank as I expected. We're gonna be gathering weeds for a while. Honestly, I think we might just destroy the whole overgrowth. Like, it's not difficult to do. Why did I... Oh, right. <laughs> Boom. Over a thousand dollars in my well, over a thousand dollar hands in my pocket. I've said it before and I'll say it again. This place is the best way to make money right now for me. Now, the next zone is super nice. So it's a great right now. It's always be one of my favorite places to go to make money. Because it's so satisfying the sound this place makes. Honestly, though. I really hope I have audio recording right now for me. I don't even care about the video audio. Just the mic is important right now. I love it. Like, you guys probably think I'm crazy right now. But honestly, I'm just kind of a genius for this one. Thank <laughs> you. 
By the way, that weird clicking here, that's my uh, me moving the joystick and the controller. I'm just moving it back and forth pretty hard, actually, which probably shouldn't do. Holy Jesus, man. That scared me. That's the only thing I don't like about this, is you don't, which, don't get me wrong, I'm so glad you don't take fall damage. But I'm always like, oh god, I'm about to die to fall damage, because in real game, I die to fall damage a lot. I know I don't do it too much in videos, but in, like, when I'm just playing the game, I always, I, I am constantly dying to fall damage. It is genuinely my greatest fear, is fall damage. Like, it is my mortal enemy. Fall damage and wither skeletons. I can handle the Ender Dragon, I can handle the wither. Really? Right now, when I'm recording, is when you have to text me. I can handle all that. But, man, fall damage and wither skeletons. They are my two greatest fears in that game. I can even deal with creepers. Can't deal with losing wolves. That hurts me. I hate it when I lose wolves. I hate it so much. Losing wolves hurts, you know. Because them wolves be kind of like your actual dogs, just in a video game instead. But you end up caring about them after you guys have killed mobs together. After you guys have fought alongside each other. <sighs> and they become your friends. And then they die. And sometimes it brings you into a rage and you have to kill everything that you see. Everything. How did that dude get stuck in the ground? What? This guy, I don't even understand. But either way, you know, it just brings you into anger. Anger that I hate. No, sure, it's an in-game only anger, you know, it's not, and don't get me wrong, it sucks. The actual, you know, just living, and when they die, it's like, oh, man, that sucks. You know, I thought I was going to win the game with these homies alongside me, fighting the Ender Dragon. And then they die, it's like, oh, that sucks. But... In the game, you know, it makes you want to tear everything apart. In game, I have destroyed countless bases of my own because wolves died. It's almost like it taints the area so you never want to go back. I'm not going to question thousands of watermelons. I wish they, they broke, like, regular watermelons and gave you, like, five or something. And while I know that would be, like, way OP, it'd still be nice. Because then, like... They eat yourself for a hundred, and you'd be like, mm, I'm going in the dough now. But, you know. I guess, I guess just God don't love, I guess God just don't love me that much. I'm not going to sing for you guys, sorry, um, I would, but my throat is kind of itchy and sore from uh, breathing a lot today, because I was running around with a bunch of little kids chasing me, it was not pleasant, honestly, I can handle five little kids, I can handle ten, I can't handle fifty chasing me, it's like, oh Jesus, you know, I'm ducking, I'm rolling, I'm pulling all sorts of acrobatics and all sorts of ninja stuffs. I, I escaped the little kid army, but barely. Honestly, I don't think I escaped entirely intact. I think I might have lost my sanity. 
Of course, they don't throw all that just for one grass. Don't get me wrong, it's better than no grass. This grass is better than, you know, no money. Holy Jesus, man. This dude was not interested in collecting at all. He just wanted to break all the dirt. What, is he a noob or something? Think the dirt's amazing? Also, who hasn't had at least one dirt base in their life? You know, in Minecraft. Like, honestly, I admit, I've probably had 50. Just like, early on, before I feel like building an actual base, I'll just build a quick little dirt shack. You know, just enough to protect me. Not enough to look nice, but just enough to protect me. And then I've also done, like, them fancy dirt houses where I try to make it look better than just a regular dirt house. Those those are something I should record when I do stuff like that. Thankfully, my phone isn't glitching out right now. Maybe it's because I'm using my controller. It's not. No, oh, pardon me. I don't know why it isn't. Oh, it actually pardoned me because I burped. Okay, well, we definitely made some fat stacks here. Oh, 69. Nice. Well, we saw it. I mean, you didn't make a ton. I really thought we were going to make more. I don't know. I say we go back to the prison. We uh, work here for a while. What other ways are there for me to make money? Oh, I can't really think of a whole lot right now. I think we're just going to keep on mining. Maybe we should just go for the super expensive stuff, you know. The high roller stuff. The emeralds. The, uh, diamonds. There's a little rather... I wish emeralds were this common in regular Minecraft. My god. Bro, I would be the trading master. I just have a billion emeralds. So I need to get the rest of my achievements, honestly. I need to work on my achievement numbers. Also, I didn't get a single pumpkin bomb. Or jack-o'-lantern bomb, rather. I really thought I was going to get some. Yeah, so, um. Boom. Boom. Do you guys see the reasoning behind what I've done? I hope you do. Don't get me wrong, lapis, it's valuable, it is, like, it's super useful. Especially like, in-game, oh my god, I, I harvest so much lapis, constantly mining for lapis. I love lapis. Also, I need to, honestly though, I do need to get my achievements all done. 
if you guys don't realize it, but, like, I only have, like, half my achievements, not even in Minecraft, done. Because on my old account, um, way back in Kentucky, I did have them all done. And I was, like, super proud of that, because, like, how fast I got them done. I think I got them done in, like, a week and a half. And I had... I don't. I did them all in multiple worlds. You know, it's not like I did it all in the same one. You know, I just kind of tried to speed run it, which that would not be a very fast speed run, but it would still be kind of a speed run. No, you know, Minecraft is one of those games where you can beat it super fast. You know, not super fast like twenty minutes fast, but like super fast like an hour and a half fast. You know, people do it all the time, and I'm not one of those people who just does it like that. I'm pretty sure I could. Like if I really pushed myself and I had a good spawn, I'm pretty sure I could do it that fast. But there's no real point to it, you know? Honestly, I should just put my phone on Do Not Disturb. That way I don't get no notifications. I don't have 50 piece for it. My god, those emeralds are valuable. You know, 150 piece, and if I were to sell 64 of them... Oh. That'd only be 9,000. For some reason, I was thinking it was like 90,000, but then it'd have to be 1,500 apiece. It'd be $9,600, which is still a fat stack, don't get me wrong. Like, I would take it. It's better than no money, so that's for sure. 11,000% for sure. Also, Deckwall, if you watch this video, just know, buddy, I'm coming for you. I'm going to take you down. I'm going to. It's not a threat. It's a promise. It's a promise, Dakota. Or I'm Java Java. It's a promise. It is a promise. Extra capital P's and R's. Promise. Okay. Nobody text me. Okay. So now we're going to go to the next level. And you guys are genuinely going to like this one. Alright. Let's go on through. Which the thing is, this is the right one. Maybe it's the level after. I can't. Now I can't remember. But if you can't tell, the one after this one is super expensive. Oh, oh is, this it? is this it? Yes, it is. You tell me this thing just ain't awesome. Like, it is awesome, isn't it? Also, um, so as when I first did this level, I thought the blocks were going to be super expensive. They aren't. But diamonds are now super common as well as the blocks. The blocks are like the cobblestones. And uh, the gold, the iron box are like the cobblestones. The gold ones are like um, the lapis and stuff like that. The lapis and the emeralds and the other one. Whereas the iron box are all cobblestone pretty much. Also, you know what I don't understand about Minecraft? It's no harder to break an iron block than it is to break a cobblestone. Not really, at least. You know, I, you... I feel like an iron block should be, like, super durable. Just like a diamond block should be, like, super durable in Minecraft. And not one of them blocks you can break pretty easy. You know, you can just blow it up with some TNT real quick, like. I don't know, maybe it's just me who feels that way. Let me know in the comments if you think the same thing. I genuinely want to know how many... Oh my god, please. How many more people there are out there who see it like that? It's like, if, I don't know if you've ever messed around with iron or anything like it, you know, iron, steel. I'm sure you guys have held some. I don't know if you've ever, you know, tested it, tried to make something out of it. It's not an easy thing, like, it's a difficult process. 
anyone who says it isn't or is an easy thing is lying to you because they've never done it. And they've never tried to do it. I've seen Master Smiths fight Wily Old Iron, as it's called. And yes, that is something it is called. I am a amateur blacksmith. I am no master smith, not yet at least. But I am a blacksmith. Not as good as I'd like to be. I wish I was better. But I am still fairly good. Good enough to be able to make stuff I could use in a fight. That, at, at the very least, I'm good enough to do stuff like that. I could make a sword pretty well. I can make a solid sword. I love swords. I love swords so much. I love using swords. I don't know why. It's just like an addiction for me. I genuinely might be a sword addict. Thank you. I don't know what I was hitting my head. Oh, that was almost dangerous. Move in. That gold, get the gold, get the gold. <laughs> also, thank you to everyone uh, who donated at the um, charity that today. Thank you to uh, everyone who volunteered. Uh, thank you to everyone who helped out. Thank you to all the fishermen who braved that terrible uh, wind and still stayed out there and fished. Uh, I, I, I'm sure you guys are confused why I'm saying thank you. If you weren't there, then I'm not going to explain it to you. Uh, thank you to everyone who came, just in general. Thank you to everyone who bought stuff, uh, you know, tickets for the raffle. Because, well, you know, that was money we were giving to people with cancer. Uh, but thank you for all that. All that thank you very much about. We wouldn't be able to do it without people who help out. Well, maybe I could. That's because I'm, like, cracked at doing weird stuff. You know, cracked at planning stuff that makes zero sense to anybody but me. Because of the way I plan stuff. Also, why is there so much gold? This is going to be one long video, honestly. Like, I'm not leaving until I get the diamond pickaxe. Okay, I might leave before I get the diamond pickaxe. I don't know. It, we'll find out. I could just... I don't know. It could be worth it to just mine up iron. They're 160 a piece, honestly. Pickaxe upgrades, enchantments. I honestly, I think it's going to be worth it. Oh, I think it's going to be worth it to just mine up iron super fast with the efficiency five, or other blocks similar to it. You know, because all, all these blocks are super valuable. Boom, 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 boom. Also, if you don't store your iron in blocks at your base when you've got you know that extra iron. Well, there's something wrong with you. Like, if you have enough iron, store it in blocks, please. No one likes to have to get out a bunch of stacks and carry them in their inventory. You can cut, you can cut down your storage by so much just by doing the simple thing of storing it in blocks, man. Like, it doesn't take as much room. It's the smart thing to do. I can't be the only one who sees it that way, right? Well, iron is one of them things where it's just easier to store it in blocks. Because it's not a super duper rare thing. No, don't get me wrong. It's not something that everyone has a ton of all the time. But it's fairly easy to get a bunch of. Also, this is like honestly the smartest thing I think I've ever done. Because think about it, I only have to mine up a hundred with this pickaxe. And I mean like a hundred iron. Not all the other stuff I'm mining up as well. But 100 iron to pay this pickaxe off. I can easily mine up twice that amount of stuff. Because it's based off the amount of blocks, not the blocks that you mine up. And, I don't know if the um, durability matches, but I think an iron pickaxe is what, like 
500 durability. Which means, yeah, we're good. Maybe it doesn't have 500. Maybe it has 350. I can't remember now. I don't know. We can just check by finding out how many blocks I mined up. I'm sure it's not scaled with what it normally has, because why would it be? You know, why would you want that? But iron pickaxes have very nice durability. Not as nice as diamond pickaxe, but... I mean, the diamond pickaxe doesn't have as nice of durability as a netherite pickaxe. Not that I really use them, because I suck at gathering netherite, because it takes too long, so I prefer to just uh, gather diamond. Even if netherite is technically better. It's not that much better that I find it to be super worth it. I mean, a sword, yeah. A sword, yeah. Maybe even a pickaxe, but the armor, I don't know. Doesn't it reduce fall damage? Isn't that, like, its big thing, is it reduces fall damage? It has the same amount of armor as uh, diamond. I'm pretty sure all it does other than that is uh, reduce fall damage. Which with me would be really useful because I, like I said earlier, I am so bad at it. Fall damage has killed me more times than just about anything else. I've died less times to the ender dragon than I have fall damage. I've fought the ender dragon way more times than I should have. Like way too many times for my sanity. I think I fought the Ender Dragon like 20-ish times in a single year back in Kentucky. Since I moved to Kentucky, I think I've only fought it 8 times, which is still quite a few. So, 8 times more, or no, that's probably 7 times more than most players choose to. And I did it, you know, all in survival, no cheating, which sucked balls. Sucked big fat monkey balls. Also, we are getting so much loot. We are getting all of the loot. We are going to have all of the monies, honestly, bro. We are going to be the richest player on the server. I intend on just gathering up way more money than I need. Oh, wow. Thank you very much. Nice. Man, that is so smexy. Makes me so happy. Thank you so much to all of you who have, actually genuinely though, thank you so much to all of you guys who have supported my channel uh, from day one or even from day 15. It doesn't matter. You guys have been there for me. It really does help out a lot. The fact that you guys are still watching my videos, you guys are still liking and commenting on all my videos, or at least those of you that are commenting. By those of you, I mean like the two of you who have commented. Hint, hint, wink, wink. Comment on my videos, please. I have children to feed. Can't do that if I'm not making that yummy, yummy YouTube ad revenue. You know what I'm saying? Chipmunk, now is not the time. Oh my god. Ugh. I'm wired to worry about that kid because I know how dumb she is. And that's not even me just being insulting, that's just me being honest, bro. We are actually doing great, though. We are going to make all of the money in the map. We are going to be so rich. I'm actually going to... I don't know if I'm going to have enough after this video in particular. But if I do, then I'm going to take you guys to the next zone. Oh, wow. Oh. Oh, she was just replying to my text message. Okay, I know what it was about. Yeah, I replied to something about her story in a joking manner. I guess she talked, uh, took it literally. Also, uh, that, um, Nerf Gun video did really well. Like, way better than I expected it to. I thought it would do well because I got shot by my grandpa in it, but I did not think it would do that well. Also, I'm going to record a vlog today to post tomorrow morning because I've been doing really bad about the late uploads and I feel really bad about it. Also, if someone could comment if they watch this video tonight. Do we have school tomorrow? I don't know. It is President's Day after all. So we might not. I don't know. I genuinely don't. I've been trying to remember all day. I don't remember uh, any of my teachers saying that we didn't. I don't know how to take the extra gold out. I've been trying to figure that one out myself, kid. Okay. 
So let's go. Ba boom! Holy, holy Jesus, man! All right, so we are not getting the diamond pickaxe though. Like the diamond pickaxe is so expensive, two hundred and fifty k expensive. But ladies and gents, I think that is going to be the end of this particular video, just because it's already like thirty five minutes long. So goodbye, everyone. Have a wonderful day. Um, yeah. Good night.